And because he, who hurt him? I do not know what woman hurt him. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But he, like, he'll never, he'll never acknowledge the truth. I can't ever just talk to my people without him just being psychotic. Yo, yo, yo. This is Peanut, digital baby mom. Like, comment, and subscribe so you can pay for this motherfucking child support. Y'all know he broke his hand, so y'all know we need all that motherfucking money. Yeah. And don't forget, my name is Peanut. Show me some money, too. Mm. So I guess Ari Lennox heard what uh, Joe had to say and pretty much spazzed on him, calling him a dog abuser, saying his breath stinks and everything else. Like, Shorty was going crazy on Joe Buttons, you dig? But it kind of made me sad, though, like, on, on a real, like, how are we ever going to survive in this world, man? Everyone wants to play victim. Nobody wants to take accountability ever. The joke she made about homie was funny, but if you actually listen to what he was saying, he gave her great advice, bro. Great artistic advice and great personal advice. He pretty much was saying him, Parks, and even um Ish got involved in it a little bit. He pretty much was saying like, yo, life is hard. And if you want to survive in this world, you got to keep your head together. You have to be resilient. You have to take apples and make apple juice. You have to keep it moving. Stop playing victim and fight. And if you do not want to go on that tour, talk to your people. There's a miscommunication between you and your people. But stop talking about it after the tour has ended. You made a lot of money. You made some fans. But you also took it as an opportunity to be the victim, dog. Which when... When people like Ari Lennox and shit be doing that, I really do be questioning it. I really, 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 really do be questioning it. Like, I don't know if it's like a market strategy or like just them trying to get some kind of sympathy. Like, there's a lot of people in this world who have anxiety and who be depressed. And I feel like there are a lot of people who kind of like are, they, they kind of make themselves that because there is incentives to be that way. There is a lot of incentives. Like, they want to get baby, like their children. Yo, you're a grown ass woman, 32, turning 33. And March on March 26th. Murder B, you see you crash my. Like I said, dog, Joe. But you better make sure you give me my bread or it's a all that, dog. problem. Gangster. You have to be resilient when it comes to these situations. Same thing with NBA Young Boy. It's true what Joe said about NBA Young Boy. And how I know, I listen to those albums, all those albums. Most of those NBA, most of those NBA Young Boy albums, he was throwing out. It's all bullshit. It was all filler bullshit. I don't even know why the label let him put that out. It was all bad. It was all terrible. Let's be honest about it. Maybe the colors joint wasn't too bad, but other than that, most of those albums was trash. So why get upset when somebody calls it out? Instead, maybe take some kind of constructive criticism. NBA young boy, you know you in the house probably making all those songs in, in 10 minutes. You Let's be honest about it. I could hear it. We love you for having music that got some kind of soul in your heart. And I can hear that, nigga. You, you in the house board just knocking out a song every 10 minutes and just put, putting on the album, just throwing it out there, though. I could hear that in the albums. Look, man. Ari can respond any way that she wants because they spoke about her. But damn, man, I really do feel bad for this chicken life, dog. Like I said, she turns 33 in March. So I guess she's chosen the life of being a victim because homie actually gave her some good advice. I would hate to see her fall off and you have to get a nine to five. Like I would hate to see her survive in like the real, real, real world and shit. Like <sighs> digital thugs them out. Like comments. Love Rory because you know what's crazy, Rory. I love you. I'm gonna probably say something really shady, but how is it? How is it? A man who is white. I, I'm, I may get dragged for this, has always from jump validated me, seen me, loved me, always supported me, always understood me. How is it him? How is it? Like, what is that energy? Rory is the most beautiful, soulful man inside and out like just the most beautiful angel in the fucking world how is it how is it that that could be he's been a fucking real one he's been seen me he's been understood me in every fucking way and i'll never it's just embarrassing 
it's embarrassing of of Joe to hate black women so much. It's em- 